Oh, good lord, let me just compose myself. Welcome to <laughs> the inside of our new Pagani Huayra. I mean, some remarkable sentences have come out of my mouth over the years, but nothing quite so poignant as that sentence, and also nothing quite as important as what I'm about to share with you right now. So, at the end of this video, the intention is to have laid out the most exciting roadmap which I could possibly think of presenting to you. So, just before I go down that route of telling you about the next chapter of the Mr. JWW channel and the new garage, I'll touch on that in a moment. We have all ultimately subscribed to this channel or followed or viewed or even clicked on this video for the first time because at heart, we're all diehard petrol heads. So we're gonna to touch on the Huayra first. I can't believe that word's coming out of my mouth or the fact that I'm in this thing. And then after that, we're gonna outline this game-changing roadmap. So, as a quick overview, and then later on, we'll do a full immersive, in-depth walk and talk, beautiful shop production and first drive. But Pagani Huayra, uh, you could class it as the successor to the Pagani Zonda. It still runs the uniquely developed AMG V12 engine, only the biggest difference from the Zonda to the Huayra is that this is heavily twin turbocharged, resulting in 720 horsepower and over 730 pounds-feet of torque, sir. Pounds-feet! In a package that kind of weighs around about the same as a 3 Series. Ridiculous stuff. Now, for all of its incredible sculpture, pushrod suspension, amazing V12 engine, and remarkable uh, active aero. These ailerons that adjust at the front when you're turning in and braking is something to behold. One of my favorite features is, wait for it, the carbotanium. No, that's not a fictitious material that I've plucked out of an X-Men film. That is in fact a composite which Pagani developed, which is a blend of carbon fiber with a, <laughs> this is ridiculous, titanium weave that flows through it to create the tub of this car that all of that wonder is ultimately connected to. And I think that is the thing about hypercars, isn't it? <laughs> I can say the word hypercar on this channel. <laughs> That's the thing about hypercars, is it's often the details that you don't immediately see that categorizes them as a hypercar. Speaking of which, I'm now going to outline how, and importantly why, this car can join this channel as a permanent member of the new garage. Now, you may have picked up on that I've referred to this car as ours and as to how we are going to elevate the channel to the next level. Well, I'm really, really proud and a little bit emotional to announce that my very close friend and mentor through both business and life, right, because we've been discussing what's about to unfold for the best part of 12 months together we are launching a joint venture and joint company called The Production Bunker. So you might be thinking, well, what is The Production Bunker? Well, don't get concerned because it's not gonna detract from Mr. JWW. It is in fact the new engine room of the channel. You can think of it as the new garage, the garage which we never really had. It's gonna be the roadmap for content that I always dreamed of truthfully when I started this channel, but to be honest, the kind of content that I want to make and I'll be truly proud of is the kind of stuff that I can't create on my own. So the bunker name that you've heard has always had this in the background, but we launched this just before lockdown and we were supposed to unravel and share what I'm about to share with you now a long time ago. But of course, the whole world got put on pause along with ourselves and it's taken until now for it to be the opportune moment to share with you what this new company and joint venture is all about for you and the channel and all things awesome ongoing. And there's lots of other cars behind the scenes and there's lots of other cars that we've decided to bring to the channel in order to elevate the kind of content that we can bring to you. So, what's happening? How are we doing it? Well, the bunker which we launched at the beginning of the year was supposed to become the production bunker really soon, but of course the whole world got put on pause 
Uh, but I'm really happy to announce that construction has started in the bunker as we speak. Walls are being knocked through, structure is being integrated, and there is a significant six-figure sum being invested into the self in order to create this studio where we can begin to create content that we've always dreamt of. Think electric turntable, studio grade soft lighting, the acoustics, no longer will we sound like we're in an echo chamber, and editing suite, production studio. We now have our own track, which will be evolving further now that lockdown is eased. And then comes the cars. And this for me is where it gets really exciting. I, through the production bunker, are putting a lot of investment into developing our joint dream garage and car collection. Now at this stage, I want to announce something which I've been holding back on a strong noose for months. Well, I'm just beyond proud and excited to announce that the Valkyrie will become a permanent member of the production bunker garage. And it will be the UK's first Aston Martin Valkyrie. It's gonna be part of the channel, it's gonna be part of the production bunker, it's gonna be part of the garage, and it's gonna be a permanent member of this channel. What I'm gonna be doing over the coming weeks and months is introducing you to all of the other cars which we have collectively invested in and are putting into the production bunker and the garage to support the Mr. JWW channel. What I would like you to do at this stage is go and follow on Instagram at the production bunker. This is where all of these new cars will be announced. That They'll also be supported on, on my Instagram account as well. But this will be the garage and the home of where these cars will live. But it's about to get real with a garage on YouTube, which is unprecedented. I don't think it, it needs to be any longer about look at what cars I'm buying. The celebration for me has always been the cars. And I think the celebration ongoing should be all about these incredible machines. And to really give you some context and to prove just how much of a part of the channel these will permanently be, I would like to hear from you in the comments what you would like to see from us do with these cars. I mean, it's a, this, is a, this is a ridiculous opportunity. And over the next few weeks, I'll be dropping into the channel all of the different cars that will be featured in the coming weeks and months. Let me just preface this with, it's absolutely ludicrous. <laughs> and we're gonna use them properly. And this is the biggest thing. When you borrow cars from brands, you can't always use them as they were fully intended. Yes, they get driven, but you can't always put them head to head. Some brands don't want their cars up against other brands on the same screen. That's a real story. And I think in order to really put these things through their paces, exploit them for what they're worth, excuse the cheesy phrase, but truly burn rubber and find out what these cars are all about, pushing them to the extremes, drag races, road trips, track days, everything in between, that's what the production bunker is all about. And it's all about taking it and elevating the quality of it to the next level in terms of things that we want to see. And so what does this mean for you? For the very loyal fans, followers, subscribers, everyone who's commented, liked, and shared these videos over the years, what does it mean for you? Well, as I mentioned at the beginning of this, I, I always wanted to try and put you in the driver's seat as best as I could for the most descriptive words that I could conjure up to try and translate to you what these incredible machines are all about. Well, I'd like to announce right now that the Production Bunker and Mr. JWW brand will be going on tour across the UK and eventually across Europe and eventually across the world to hold events and filming sessions in areas near you. The most important thing is that we'll be holding flagship events where thousands of you will be invited to come down and immerse yourself in the, the brand experience alongside leading figureheads of the automotive industry, get to see these incredible cars going around our track, come down for live sessions and events with amazing people, special cars, and just fantastic events at the production bunker. All of this will unfold. You'll be able to go online on the new mrjww.com website, which hasn't launched right now, but will soon. But it is really literally and physically about getting you down physically, in human form, to come and get involved in what this world of cars is all about. And it, this won't be a select few, this will be open to as many people as we can for the public facing events that we can achieve with the space and the production bunker that we've got. So it's gonna be a massive change to bring in audience tangibly into this incredible world. 
So here we are, sat in the first car that I'm officially introducing to the channel as part of the new team and the new lineup which will be available to us ongoing. So, questions and comments below. We've got access to hypercars, we've got access to supercars, we've got access to everything in between, multiple things which are yet to be released. I appreciate you can't see them with your own eyeballs yet. As always, thanks so much for watching. <laughs> I'll see you next time. Ciao.